Hello well, and welcome to another video for Ty's channel. This will be another My Strict Showcase. Now, I've already covered this on my channel, but I've yet to do it on Ty's. Alright, so, um, as you all know by now, both Ty's and my channel, things on My Street are tense right now. Um, but, the last season before it, Starlight, most of the season except for a few parts, like Lucinda breaks in and... Aaron's Choice and Half Mountain Pain, and even this episode called Scars. Where is it? Scars, right here. So, um, I'm going to play the Scars scene here. After that, I will be playing the end of the Starlight season, and um, you're going to see uh, it pretty much leads up to what's happening now in my street. It's just how this calm and collected season ended. There we go. There we go. We'll find this first and then we'll go to the other ones. This shouldn't take more than five minutes because I did a showcase of this on its own on Ty's channel. That was the very first one. That's why I'm repeating this along with some other shit I'm showing in this video. That voice. It's me. But that showcase was the first one on Ty's channel. It doesn't have many views. That's why I'm doing this again. I just took my camera this time. I'm sure the sound was messed up when I did the fucking mobs and things. So I was using mobs when I did the other one. Eric, are, are you okay? Is something wrong? I, I couldn't sleep. Do you want to... You... You were with him. You with him. to help you. You never spent time making friends. No friends to help you. You never spent time making friends. The only reason I ever talked to you was because I felt sorry for you. The only reason I even talked to you is because I felt sorry for you. I wish I never met you. I wish I had never met you. You never made me happy. You never made me happy! I never loved you! I never loved you! My voice... He's been using that too. So, okay, now we're on to the end of Starlight, which is what leads up to the crazy shit, shit now. From Garnet. No, 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 I'm not playing all three videos in its entirety. As a matter of fact, I'm skipping a good majority of this one. Mmm, shit. What I can't say I'm particularly proud of. Go on. Years ago, I was friends with a man named Michael. Michael was a charming man. Very witty, very cutting. Though at the time, you couldn't tell that. Michael was very obsessed with witchcraft potions. You name it. Anything that had to do with things of that sort. At first, it seemed like an innocent enough hobby. Witches and warlocks exist and they make the world a better place if their power is used for the greater good. 
But Shane Michael didn't do this really good, good, and Ian tried to make Lucinda do that same shit. We've been that way since college. Alright. After speaking with Michael, we met two other people, Zach and Elizabeth. After a time, Garte, Michael, Zach, and Elizabeth and I got to know each other more and all became close friends. Then one day, Michael made a proposal. He knew Zach and Elizabeth were doctors, very good ones at that, top of their field. But not only that, they were good at knowing witchcraft and incorporating that into their treatments. Garte and I were good at knowing how to sell things. We were good at knowing how to make something of Spoiler alert, Zach's gonna want to kill Michael. Healing. Michael was purely invested in witchcraft and new things. I'll probably showcase why. I think you guys Realms, know why I'm saying that. Magics, sorcery, Half miles dead. things I never even heard of. One day, Michael proposed to us an idea. What if we could save the My world? Step two. What if we could help people who don't know what's good for them? Both help them see the way. The kids that came happiness. from Zach are dead. At that now. time, we weren't sure what he meant by yeah, that. Yeah, I think it's just gonna have problems. Our attention. The fact that Apple we all and to Ian died. Put those two better. together. Who we we're gonna have a team be well. That would benefit everyone, or at least I thought we all did. Michael, Zach, and Elizabeth started to work on a special kind of potion, a potion that would cure diseases, heal the incurable. And grant people incredible. Yeah, as far as importing these Meanwhile, videos, unless my stream is uploaded today to or tomorrow, or something like that. To the project. Investors Michael had suggested. I'm probably gonna wait to import all these videos. Some of these investors. Actually, my stream's uploaded today. I'm just they importing that today. Yeah. But questions. if it's they uploaded later on, uh, like tomorrow or even Sunday, that will be imported to the other videos. Michael suggested we try them on the children, our children. I oh, that's what I'm doing this video. Not uh, the only last showcase I did is no werewolf. But because I didn't believe on using these potions on children, but that didn't stop Michael from convincing everyone else to do it. And they did. Gareth. Caitlin. They had potions used on them. I know for a fact they did. How many, I'm not sure. Zack's daughter, Aphmau. I can't say for certain. I think he had a son, but I honestly don't remember. I should have spoken up. I should have said something and stopped them from doing that to those children. But I didn't. And I let it happen. Once the children had shown promise that the potions worked, well, it's the game came to directions. sell the potions. We it's did. Videos, and the people yeah. who bought them, they wanted to do horrible things. They were nothing but Hugs with big bank accounts. And I should have seen that. But Michael. Michael was obsessed with something else. Something far more valuable than selling these potions. He was interested in some stone. S stone? I don't know what. Okay, excuse me. What fucking stone? I don't remember that. This is season five. Ruben was talking about some stone thing about getting a relic from Aaron or something like that. It's by... by book! It has a spell, right? Can literally turn someone's soul into a stone. I... Ruben might have just predicted something. If that does happen to Aaron. One day. Gartain we'll say that happens in the next episode. And Michael said he and needs started a power. Michael, Zach, and Elizabeth. That is stronger than his own. Yeah. Michael used something. And the ultimate power. He called it his realm. It's unlimited. However, yeah. he turned By the range. tables and they fell into their own trap. Pretty much. After that, so basically, and I took the money, shut down the business, and just just stand up some stuff. That's what the Derek just said. Okay. All the work, books. I've watched this back how many times and I never we caught that. The but that's because he never mentioned never it of any stone before <laughs> when I saw this we went on our separate ways and started our own companies. And plus your companies well, centered around the ideas of bringing joy to people. everyone. Yeah. That's how we came into our fortune. At least that thing. I'll have to go back to the video. I did record this it. Is off now. Gareth. Yeah. Caitlin. You have to be kidding me. Why did I need to know this? We are in danger, Melissa. Those three, who we thought were gone, are back. And they're here on Starlight. I'm telling you this because if something happens to me or your mother, someone needs to know. Just please.
<laughs> oh my god, quad chair. <laughs> you right. Uh -huh. Sure. We're here. Awesome. I think we're gonna wait a bit before we head out. Give a few peeps some time to show up, but not too long. Yeah. Dinner awaits. Afmel, I must say your outfit is adorable. <laughs> Thanks. Ever help me pick it out? Let me see. Ooh, the fabric is on point too. I is it? Oh, is it snuggly? If only I had sleep that was snuggly. Aww, do you need my help to sleep tonight? No. Oh, that sounds romantic. Shut up! Zane. <laughs> <I'm insane. laughs> Alright, here it is. Spock pretty much gave it a big hint of what was to come in the next season. That woman that, um,. He is with is Caitlin's mom, just so you guys know. Ian! Fucking green eyed, blue hair streak, fuck boy. Can't trust him, he has green eyes. My turn! Wait, it's true! He yeah. actually has green I eyes! I know! It's those green eyes! <laughs> Just so everyone knows, that's been the newest trigger thing for Ruben. He wanted to start that you're supposed to be dead, so now I got this green eye thing to respond with. Alright, next. We're gonna have to show a case of the cost of housing was a crisis. Too, believe, so. And Prop 10 makes that crisis worse. These two. Although there won't be too much to showcase in the last episode, but this one, there was actually quite a bit. This one will be a rather big showcase, by the way. It's just quite a big show. Melissa! Rachel! Next showcase will be from Lover's Lane. Melissa! On it! There will be a few days from now. Though. Yeah. I'm gonna finish my show. Kill your eyes! Before I do showcase, huh? Aaron! Get a hold of yourself! Aaron! Aaron Lichen! Calm yourself! Ian! What? What did he say? There's even hints in Lover's Lane of a possible Zane and Koi Chang getting together. Aaron! Stronger than that one except in season two. Aaron! And that is when God turns into a werewolf. Not right away, but this happened is what done and become an oil. Say that fox name. I, I don't. All right. <laughs> yeah, this is when you have to be serious. Uh, oh, you know, actually. No, no, you guys will wait. You'll see something funny that happens with Melissa in the next episode. What in Irene's name were you thinking? I didn't mean to affect Garth! I... This isn't about him right now. You better hope to Irene he'll live through what you just set in motion for him. But right now I'm more concerned about what you did to her. Huh? Do not play dumb for his sake! Don't yell at her! You turned her! There is no way she would be standing right now if you didn't! I saw her look you straight in the eye, and she didn't even flinch! 
The only way she would be able to do that is if you... Boom. Werewolf. Oh, and I come to realize and remember that Abnon was a potion werewolf for three straight episodes on Lover's Lane. So I did notice that. I guess that was a big hint of her becoming a werewolf. I don't know. Irene's name would possess you to do such a thing. Half is my city kind of a foreshadowing thing. I to spend the rest of my life with. The reason I turned her was for her own safety. That's not. You had mom! Mom was already a werewolf and you didn't have to worry about turning her! But Af, I ran the risk of losing her. Do you understand? Your actions have consequences. Her entire biology, her bone structure, everything has changed. What are doctors going to do when they look at her medical records and realize that she's changed? That's not... Do you not see what he's caused? Mia? Mom! Derek, I see that what's been done is done. Yelling isn't going to do anything. But he- We should be rejoicing this engagement. But as it stands, it seems we need to come together and discuss what choices have been made today. Indeed. Athma? May I please speak with you in private? Y yes, Mom. <coughs> please, I need you to explain to you two things. One, why did you turn off now? And two, why did you have your outbreak of rage? I see. If that's the case, then I can understand why Aaron wanted to turn you. But what I can't understand is, why did you want to be turned? Huh? This decision, I want to hear your reasoning. I... I wanted to turn because I wanted to understand Aaron better. I felt that something was calling me to... What? I didn't want Aaron to be going alone through something again. I wanted him to know I was there, and... That's not a good reason to become a werewolf. <sighs> Mija, we are Hispanic. Someone doesn't have to become Hispanic in order to understand us. That's ignorant and... without <coughs> disrespectful to that culture. Essentially, that's what you did. I... Except for I the werewolf culture, not think Mexicans. think about it that way. No. You didn't think about it that way. I'm disappointed in you. One other thing. You said that something was calling to you. What do you mean? I... I don't know. I felt a part of you wanting to be turned. But with the idiotic reasoning I had, it wasn't justified. It... <sighs> Mia. Yes. You had a dumb reason for turning, but that calling, perhaps, a part of this is my fault. Huh? But, Mia, your <clears throat> father, huh? nothing, never mind, tell me, it's nothing, I have to go. No, Mom, you never, ever bring up Dad. Not even when I was little did you ever even make mention of him. N not to my face. Now suddenly you mention him? It's not important. Mom. Mia. He's... He just... <sighs> Your father was a werewolf. Mom. If you're trying to make me feel better for a stupid decision that I made, this isn't the way, Miha. It's true. It is. I've seen Your the werewolf hear some tail on him. was a werewolf. <laughs> you're lying. I swear it on my grave. Then, 
Why am I not? You didn't take after him. Human and werewolf relationships don't always produce children of the same descent as their parents. It's either one or the other. And you, you were pure human. Oh, oh but sorry. you still had your father's blood in you. Which is why when you said that you had a calling, I thought, maybe it was that part of you. But I had tried to nurture that part in you when you entered high school. Huh? What do you mean? When you entered high school, I... I put you in the werewolf class on purpose. What? I wanted to see <laughs> if you would take to it. Then maybe... Maybe I would try to reconnect with your father. Wait, what? Why? Even if you tried, you couldn't. What? You wouldn't have been able to Dad, do that anyways up until heard. recently. You never told me. Yes, I'm I have. I told him he was selfish and jerk. He painted a beautiful picture of me. Most of the time you probably he wanted was... to see that what could have worked. happened? Couldn't have your happened because father, of what Derek man. and Garte did. We... We never married. We were going to, but then... Before this season, the Lord, secrets got exposed. Even more that being that exposed in the season one now. That he he had cheated on me. He had a child from another woman. <coughs> yeah. And I didn't know about it until she called me and showed me proof. He, he there were more things. He, he never cared for me the way he did when we met. He treated me horribly. There were just so many things that added up. I'm surprised Perhaps I would have tried to make it work if I had thought he had actually loved that. me. That he yeah, had it, it is Elizabeth. I know this for a fact because of the strangeness with My Kevin's world mom. was you. And, and I didn't want Watching back Lovers Lane, Caitlin mentions and hints that he died. Or she died. <laughs> no. She was want him to do the same thing to his family. At the time Caitlin that said that, she was still me. in that realm. But still. I guess. And I'm still wondering how the fuck some ways. did they escape? Wow. Michael. Yeah, but. Yeah, you know how Michael. Unless is. Michael found the air uh, power and back and actually no, escaped his own realm. Yeah. Plus, uh, Derek didn't do it perfectly. I never knew Dad. And I never knew Zach Dad to actually try to, to reach out to talk to him. And uh, I think it was the hotel right up so. <laughs> He helped raise you with money, which I never asked for. So if that shows you anything, that at least shows he cares about you. Not enough to show up to anything, apparently. I understand. You can't. It's best. You don't know everything don't yet. Think about him. I honestly believe he was up to no good. No good enough, but not everything. Things I remember. It's up to you if you ever want to reach out to him. Now that you know who he was, but I'd personally advise against it. But that's your choice, not mine. You should have. Mom. That could have helped things. Everything. It's no problem, Mia. I love you. I love you too, Mom. So, what's going on with your tail? It's. Um. I honestly don't know. Aaron and I were talking about this the other day, and my tail doesn't seem to have developed yet. Does it hurt? No, it just looks funny. Mom? It says it developed yet. Garth is alright. No, but I overheard what's happening. This could mean serious trouble. Oh, how little you knew! He didn't know anything unless there. someone had gone. I saw him! I saw him and I wanted to! Aaron! My future son. Control eyes. yourself! <laughs> what? Your eyes, son. Uh, Ian is dead. We never recovered the body. I saw him, I swear! Aaron, you said this before. Remember? There was a guy who looks just like him. You also flipped out then, too. That was. I've heard enough. It's clear to me, Aaron, that you are unstable right now. But I... While I agree with your father on your anger, 
I do not agree that we should dismiss the fact that Aaron might have seen something. Aaron, did you see anyone else with Ian? Uh, there was this other woman. Blue hair. She looked similar to Caitlin. Oh, you got surprised? Believe him now, bitches! <laughs> Bluish green eyes and... Excuse me. I need to step out. <coughs> oh, please. <coughs> Tell me. How's going? He's not good. The doctor we had on standby is seeing to him. Oh, well, looks like the next episode, I, you're going to be used as I, a meteor. I don't know. As a cannonball, Aaron. Good man. To destroy a meteor. job was to keep that monster of a son of yours controlled! Don't call him a monster! Well now thanks to him, my son is on the brink of life and death! I'm doing everything in my power to make sure he lives. Garte, please. This was an accident, but there's something else. What else could be more important than- Elizabeth is here, which means they're all here. And they have the boy who knows how to make forever potions. The one who tried to kill our kids before. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Huh, Garton. Elizabeth. He also said he saw a boy from the lodge. The connection of those two with the thought of forever potions. Plus, Zack is here, Garte. I know that. I know they escaped the realm we sealed them in. But why all here at Starlight? Why right now? <laughs> no, I right? No. How's in a fucking war on the fucking place is supposed to be a vacation place? Go on. We confirmed blood trails and assumed he was. Crazy. We never recovered the body. do so imagine how things would turn out if all this shit went down on directly Earth on Lover's Lane. Have that fucking city would probably be destroyed if it all happened If there. we think about it, Garte, we're yeah. going to act on our suspicions. That will probably provoke them. That this all we've talked about this. this. Still, I don't think my family had any more trouble than we're already somewhere. in. I saw hey, love, love paradise. Eric. There's numbers of bolts of big resurfacing. I know. Yeah. We've made Not all our family family aside from everywhere. Love the bear. Not tell him. Having competition. He is the yeah. successor of the curse. He will be the most impacted by this. I need to protect him as much as possible. Are you sure? Derek, think of what he's done to my son. Garte, you know better than I that Garth would be dead by now if he was truly going to die. Why does that matter? That doesn't stop the pain he's going through! This forever potion is keeping him alive, isn't it? Don't you bring it up, you- I'm right. No, I don't want to remember that. It's a part of our past, Garte. The hell we put those children, our children, through. We will always remember it. I wanted to believe we were doing something good, Derek. The only good that's come of it is that you inadvertently saved Garth's life from this event. Will the potion you put on him be strong enough for him to live through this? He and Caitlin had the strongest potions we had. I can only hope. Ziana! Garte! It's Garin! <gasps> Garth! Garth, my boy! Speak um, to me! Lost her? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, man, the real cereal. Doctor, <laughs> is he going to be alright? I could. He's in ah. a stable condition as it stands. What does that mean? Knows. It means he knows. isn't going to die. <laughs> Any time soon, anyway. Alright, well. That's that.
right wing. Oh, what's this? I'm not sure. Weren't these the guests we helped check out earlier? Yes, but that was hours ago. They were supposed to- Clean eyes! Clean eyes! Clean eyes! Oh, oh, no. Let me go see if I can speak with the pilot. Excuse me? Excuse me? I just realized that me? guy can't trust your own Excuse boyfriend. Excuse me is something wrong. True. Aside from the crowd of angry people? I mean, aside from the obvious. Why aren't these guests checked out yet? You mean you weren't informed? Informed about what? The island is shut down. What? Why on earth? There's a rumor that the Lycan family is here. People are being sent to investigate. No one is allowed to. Can you to hear me? Yeah. Alright. What's up? No, I'm just shut off. Nice. I'm just finishing up a my street showcase for your channel. Two videos got uploaded here. One's about to be uploaded and another one's uploaded now. Mm -hmm. Alright, well that's his long showcase. Uh, next thing I'm going to showcase. Might be from Lover's Domain, but I don't know yet. Uh, I might show some from Math Mouse here too. There's a couple of interesting parts of that as well. Anyways, yeah, that's it in this video. Stay tuned for the next one. Oh, and Jolly, uh, Tally is a Jiggly Bunny.